exciting, 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 exciting coming out of my personal collection. They're finally back. These babies have been on display. This comes out of the Matuka Indicolite mine. Look, there's Indicolite in the world, which is produced in Nigeria, as well as Brazil in different types of locales, etc. But there is one mine in Brazil that produces indigo, baby. Pure blue. No green, no secondary green, just blue, blue, blue. Blue, indigo blue. And that is what I collected. Guys, I have sold thousands and thousands of kilos of tourmaline out of Brazil. And I have collected the ones that are pure indigo blue. You are looking at one of the biggest you will ever see perfectly flawless. This is a 12.12 carat top gem indigo Matuka blue from Brazil. Matuka being the name of the mine where it came out. I gave it its legendary status, baby. I've held on to it. It is a rare collectible variety. Cap Florence, of course, has perfectly precision cut this stone. So the luster is the pinnacle of its quality. You can see the indigo blue shining in you know these are actually quite rare people don't understand the rarity of indicolite now indicolite is one in ten thousand tourmaline so it is one of the rarest it's actually rarer than rubellite or any other variety of indicolite but indigo blue is like the needle in the haystack i mean they just don't exist they're so rare and so difficult to find they're almost impossible to see so coming out of my personal collection big stone here 12.12 .12 carat flaw and you've got almost one and a half carat of D flawless diamonds in that ring. That ring will sit on your hand loud and proud. You've got the spring aeronautically engineered not to move on your finger. So it sits, it's proud, it sparkles, it pops, and it is a statement piece. For the collector who collects the rarities of tourmalines, if you have the best quality Pariba, the best quality Rubelite, you just bring this baby and put it right next to it because it's the best quality in Dicolite.